Hey guys, we're gonna go over two different choke techniques. The first one's gonna be the guillotine choke, and then the second one's gonna be the ninja choke, okay? So the first one, guillotine choke, my grips are gonna be here, grabbing your own wrist. So here. So if, if, if my friend shoots in, right, my friend shoots in, and I wanna finish this guillotine choke, it could be arm in, but I'm gonna slide my hand underneath the chin, and I'm gonna grab my own wrist, right? To finish it, I'm gonna either pull guard here, and I'm gonna stretch him out for the choke. Okay, so watch this. On the guillotine choke, if his head pops up, if his head pops up, I'm in trouble. He can elbow me, he can punch me here. Okay, so I actually prefer the ninja choke, right? Shot over here, and I'm stopping the shot, right? And I have this under hook over here, I'm fighting. I like to uh, get, my, get my arm in front of his neck. Here, once this is good, he doesn't feel a threat at all. And I'm gonna grab my bicep and I'm gonna cover and I'm gonna squeeze here. You can finish this choke even when you when you uh, when you go to the floor. But you're here, you get your choke. Let's say you miss your choke. You miss your choke, he pops his head out, and you're still in a safe position where you're defending. Okay, so that's why I prefer it. And also it's a little sneakier because he doesn't feel that threat. So when he shoots in here, I'm defending, defending, I slide this up. And I grab my own bicep here. Okay, we're here for the show.